guys, Jamie Fox here in snowy Bradford, Pennsylvania, and I'm at the Zippo Lighter Factory. I'm gonna step inside because it's freezing out here and check out how Zippo lighters are made and hopefully they have my custom made Jamie Fox Zippo Lighter. Let's go check it out, guys. Oh, my name's on the sign. I love it. It's yours. I'm here with Linda, who presented me my custom-made Zippo lighter, Jamie Fox. I created it myself. It was super easy, super fun, and now I have my own lighter. Who, who can say they have their own custom Zippo lighter? I can, and you can too. Swing by the Zippo Encore booth, meet me, check out the other artists who created their own Zippo lighters, and create yours too. I knocked that one out of the ballpark on that one. <laughs> we just checked out the factory and watched all the Zippo lighters being made. Now we're going to step inside and check out the history of Zippo lighters. Come on, let's go. Now, if someone were to have a, a 1930s Zippo lighter, how much would it be worth to? In this condition, mm -hmm. maybe three to four thousand. Wow, that is crazy. In this condition, mm -hmm. with our first form of imprinting, which was called the metal loop, that would be worth over $40,000. Big marks. Wow. We've always been a big part of our military, and many of these men would bring these lighters home, put them in a dresser drawer, and never use them. They're keepsakes. Yeah. I think it's really cool that you guys do that, especially the Medal of Honor uh, Zippo lighter that you guys are doing for Mayhem Fest, and all the proceeds go to all the veterans' charities, which I think is really cool because a lot of those families can benefit from that, and you can have something to take with you. You know, you're donated in charity, but yet you also get an exclusive Zippo lighter, and it means something to you. If you have a family member or a husband or a brother that's a veteran or in the war, you can kind of carry them in your pocket with you. Exactly. It's kind of cool. I just finished my tour at the Zippo Lighter Museum. It was amazing. Zippo has been involved with everything from film, music, even the military. There's 80 years of history in this building. It's super cool. I'm gonna head downtown now and check out the headquarters. I'm here at the Zippo Lighter headquarters and I'm in the garage with the custom made Zippo Jeep by West Coast Customs, which is awesome. The back is insane. And the 1947 Zippo car, this thing is so cool. It has lighters on the side. The actual car was cut in half to build lighters. That is so cool. The tops flip open and they have flames that they place inside. They don't have them right now, but trust me, it looks really cool. I'm about to go check out the headquarters and check out some more cool stuff. John, John, John's working on the, the Mastodon artwork. Essentially what we start out with is the color image from there that I have to take a draw in whatever is missing. And it's it's a very involved process. It probably took me about four or five hours to do that. And essentially from there I, I clean up the artwork and I blend it all together. So to 
want more scripts, and I press buttons. <laughs> <laughs> I do a lot of, uh, these are like, this is for Lana Del Rey, this is for Trace Atkins, this is oh, nice. Jason Aldean. Jamie Fox. Hi. Hi. Jamie is going to be the host of our um, the Vlog for Music program this year. Oh, She's going to be out on tour riding the bus with everybody and yeah. fans. And... Is that right? <laughs> yeah. You got your work cut out. Yeah. I do. Yeah. I feel like I'm going to keep everybody in line though, you know, I'm going to be a little cracking the whips. Yeah, there's got to be a leader somewhere. There you go. Yeah, well, that's great. It was nice to meet you. Great Thank you for having you. me. Thank great, you. Great to have you here. All right, guys, I have finally completed the Zippo Lighter Tour. We did the factory, the museum, the garage, and last but not least, the Zippo Lighter headquarters. I just met George Duke, the owner, and everyone else that worked here was super friendly. Also checked out the art department where all the custom lighter Zippos are created. For more information on Encore, check out ZippoEncore.com.